everybody, welcome to The Bunker. This is a live action video game of a this man here. I don't know his name. I have seen uh, Horsey Critical play this game, uh, also known as John Wolf now, since so he changed his name. Which, uh, he's my number one go-to YouTuber, so if I'm ever looking for something to watch, I'll watch all his shit first, and then I'll go on and find somebody else. But, uh, apparently he's all by himself. They're, they're uh, locked in under the bunker. There was some sort of, like, a nuclear war, or some sort of, like, a viral attack, and, uh, he's the only survivor left. So, uh, without further ado, let's just get into a new game. And I really don't remember the story whatsoever, so. July 3rd, 1986. 58 government and military personnel. This place looks packed. So you see like they're like in a war. Cries of relief. It's a boy. AKA, it's us. Point and click adventure game. Live action. I don't think it's been done since the uh, Sega. Of course, I don't know. First time I'll be playing a live action game. Oh, that's a nuclear bomb. All right. So maybe they were at war, but they're in the bunker. So, 59 adds includes us that's just been born the bunker I don't know how long this game will take to beat but I'm sure we can play it in one sitting thirty years later Day 10,988. For some reason, I was looking for a date. That's this day. So you can see, uh, population has gone down a lot. At this point, it should just be us. Okay, nice. This would be a fucked up, like, The Walking Dead. You know, set up. What if Rick woke up in this bunker all by himself? You've got to say it again, John. You'd probably be alone, Mom. I'll still be here. I'll always be here. But you've got to say it again. Thomas gonna stick to the routine, I'll be safe. I'll always, like, always be here. Stay in our rooms, I'll be safe. As long as I don't go outside, I'll be safe. That's what you think. Good boy. We've never seen outside. He's never seen outside. What do we miss it? We do time, Mum. Yes. Should we read her the Bible or Treasure Island? I mean, she, she's obviously on her deathbed. I think uh, I think we're gonna keep it light though, and just go with Treasure Island because 
you can tell that he doesn't want to uh, admit that his mom is dying and he doesn't want to you know people say the goodbyes and they say oh don't say those things so let's do treasure island bookworm one of three he was consumed by the time behind another trunk i think my kids watch Now what do we do? That'd be the worst feeling ever. Not only is your mother dead, but you're the last one that's left. All right. What's next in our agenda? So there's a schedule we gotta keep. A routine, if you will. So we got uh, number one, day 11, or day month. I'm looking for a date again. Day 11,109. So number one is medical vitamins, a dosimeter. And then we got to check the radio and then do a radiation check, check our food, and then check on our mother. So we were going to do the vitamins. We just go down the list. Check that cabinet, should be open. So vitamins. Ooh. I might fuck this up. Alright. That looks like vitamins to me. <laughs> they all look like vitamins to me. Hopefully I chose the right one. Unless I unless you just choose them in the thing. Okay, that's like an EpiPen or Oh. Radiation is just over 70 MR. That's acceptable. Okay, well, we did a radiation check, but that's lower on the thing. Oh, dosimeter. What about radiation? Okay. Next would be the radio. So, is that our radiation? Tune that radio. Trying to get the cursor off his face. Okay, nothing that way. I thought we could turn it more. That'd be that'd be that'd be cooler. Okay, radio's done. Nothing on the radio today. Radiation check. Is that for outside? Okay. 34,911 bytes free. I think it should hold Skyrim. <laughs> so there's one survivor. We've been in here for 11,109 days. And we will perform a bunker radiation check on this old Apple computer. I'm about to put in some, uh, you know, bunker Oregon Trail. Is normal. Good. Okay, radiation check. How about the food? I mean, we can't live down here forever. It's inevitable that we're going to run out of something. I need to choose my food first. Uh, what do you want to eat? Cans, cans, and more cans. Peas and carrots, I suppose. So that makes 
27 years, three months and 14 days of food left. Cool. I wish I could have seen what the other ones were. I didn't decide, but... Was he eating like one can of food a day, or...? Also check on her mum. Which she's pretty much a skeleton now. All right. It's reading time. We'll do the Bible this time, just because we didn't do the other part. Cast thy bread upon the running waters, for after a long time thou shalt find it again. Give a portion to seven, and also to eight. And thou knowest what evil should be upon this earth. If the cloud be full, they will pour out rain upon the earth. If the tree fall the, to the south or the north, in that place soever it shall fall, there shall it be. So we read the mother. And that's that it for the... Ooh, we... Now it's day two. We don't really do much down here, do we? Alright, time to take our vitamins again. If they do this another day, I'll try to go, uh... Okay, he's gonna do it automatically now. Good! Save my mouse and button clicks. Alright. Radiation is nearly ATMR. It's increasing. Oh shit. Okay, we can't go out of order yet. Or maybe we never will be able to. Go the other way, there's a whole bunch of other numbers. What if this whole time he's been tuning between 180 and whatever's down here this whole time, but this whole time there's been somebody talking up here. Radiation check. Perfect. Thank you, Apple II. Uh, what do we eat today while we sit on the crapper? I guess he's going to pick for us. Three months and 13 days left. He's starting to read to mother. You got to do something about your mother, like... We had a dreary morning's work before us. Okay, now he's reading the other one. Wind, and the boats had gone out and manned. And the ship wrapped three or four miles around the corner of the island and up around the narrow passages to the haven behind Skeleton Island. I volunteered for one of the boats where I had. Day 1111. Look at that, all ones. They should release a movie on that day. All right, let's do it all again. Vitamins, dosimeter. Do your thing. I'm just gonna sit back and let you do 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 what you do best. Seems like uh, he's got 27 years of food, but does he have 27 years of vitamins? Here we go. It's gonna be past the 80s. Radiation is over 80 mR. Well, now what are you going to do, Chuck? Still nothing on the radio. Alright. <clears throat> oh shit, now what? Somebody break in here? Ooh, that'd be fucked up. Server failure, follow up procedure, something, 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 something. <laughs> Better grab the book.
The routine has been broken. Have you been trained for this? If I find the manual, I can fix this. You can't fix nothing. Grab your uh, little... These are his little... Uh... This has never happened before. I don't know. His sculpture of everybody that he knew growing up who lived with him in the bunker. Okay, manual 238671. I gotta be able to remember that shit. This can't happen. 238671. It's time to get up, Jack. Okay, maybe it's in the drawer here. It's gotta be close by. Start with the bottom first. Look at that. The manual. In the event of severe failure, or server failure, failure, make announcement that main power, or that mains power, mains, is being shut down for maintenance. Find the fuse box located in storage room. Level two and identify damaged fuses. Locate replacement fuse or fuses. Shut off main power, wait 10 seconds. Replace damaged fuse or fuses. Switch main power back on and perform a system check. Fuck, I don't think he's left the, this uh, barracks in a long time. Find the fuse box level two. Find what level are we on? Level two. Yes, take it with you. You feel safe with him. Her, him, her, whatever. Okay. Beside a few toy collection. Got some achievements here. One's called Mother. So he put his mother, sculpture of his mother in his pocket. So... Mum, my favorite toy I made. So we got all. The, it seems like we already have all the toys sitting on the uh, on the table there. But I guess we gotta find the others. I'm not sure I can do this. No, you can. You can open it. There's nothing in there I need. Okay. Well, I thought I would look anyway. But thanks for clarifying. All right. Let's get the fuck out of here. All right. Level two fuse box on level two. We're finally gonna leave this room. Ooh, shit. All right, hallway lamp. We hear that fucking uh, Stranger Things theme coming in. Room one. Oh, that's mom's room, okay. Well, let's take a look at all the shit before we go down to, to uh, level two. I remember drawing these. It's a gun with a little gun on it. Very imaginative. God damn. So it looks like he wants to go to the moon. See the ocean. Run on, buddy. Can we take anything else with us? Yeah, she did. Hence, did. Here's some keys here. The key. Now I have to leave. Okay, so he must have been locked himself in here when everything went down. So maybe he's never left further into the bunker before. Don't seem to be anything else in there. Now we're gonna check what's on top of his mom. Mum. What do I do, mum? Well, you're gonna follow procedure. So we drew her some flowers. That's nice. Oh, but you can tell that she's a straight <laughs> she's a straight skeleton. Alright. Don't know what's in that room. Oh, that's for the key. Can we get out of this? No. So where's the inventory then? She is not gonna open it. 
I wanted to see what's down the hallway before we went out there, but that's okay. Time to shit it off the pot. What are you gonna do? Oh shit. So we are in level one, so now we're gonna go deep, deeper into the shit. If we can go back, I'm gonna do that real quick. He's hallucinating. There's nobody there, buddy. Flashback. Oh yeah. Wait, what are you supposed to do here? What do you do that for? You knew you knew you're gonna have to go get it. Flies off and spit it out. Fourteen months. At best. If we carry on as we are, eight months. But I, I've gone over it with Dr. Hart. On bare minimum, we might make 14. On bare minimum means? I didn't like to press him, but... scurvy, rickets. Christ. Then, then we all just withered away to skin and bone. Maybe I should have just left the hatch open and gone for a nice stroll in the fresh air instead. What do we do? We tell people everything's all right. It's not all right. One whiff of this and you'll have your throat slit over the last tin of peaches. Is that the way you want to die, Sam? Fighting over scraps? We could just cut your wrist now and the rest of us will split your rations. Chin up, man. It's ten minutes until the next bulletin. So they didn't have enough food, but how does he have 27 years of food left? Well, it's only one person. He's only one person, so... There's 59 in there. So that'd be at least 59 cans a day. Per meal, maybe. So here's level two. Let's see if we can go down to level three. Ooh. I feel like an asshole because he's already scared enough. Just see a zombie coming up. Rah. See him sham up the stairs. We can go back up. I'm gonna run back up and check out the hallway real quick. Man, at that point, I'd be jogging up the stairs like something's behind me. You used to do it all the time growing up, coming from the deep ass basement we had. I feel like someone's gonna grab me, so I jolt up the stairs. Okay, here's sick bay storeroom. So I wanna take a look at these rooms before we go any deeper. That's what I wanna do. So this is where this food is. I'm not hungry. Yeah, well, I'm not either. I'm not hungry. I don't need the toilet right now. So what do you dump that shit then? Okay, so... Oh, she's got a shit ton of sardines, man. I like sardines. So, today's stock check. We got 325 cans of baked beans. 576 cans of peas and carrots. 134 cans of peaches and 12,846 cans of sardines. Man. I like, I like sardines, but not for like a whole meal. Alright, now, now we're going to the Seek Bay, then this whole area will, will be explored. Oh, I don't like Seek Bay. Uh-uh. I'm 
Right, who is this? Oh, no page unturned. July 96. Patient's name, Vera Taylor. Patient reports headache from Monday a.m., vomiting and diarrhea Wednesday. Also cough with occasional so diarrhea wrong. Intermittent bowel pain, increasing pain in chest, temperature fluctuating, peaks at 100.5 degrees, blood present in feces. Conclusions. Patient showing signs of radiation sickness. Plan. Sick base day, white blood count test, monitor. Potassium iodide, 130 milligrams orally per day for four days. Review. Possible DTPA course. Notes taken by Evelyn Jones. Okay, this does not follow anything what she said. <laughs> so here's somebody that died from radiation or sickness. Something bad happened here. Don't you know? I mean, you're literally the room right next to this place. So she died. I'm guessing others did too. Alright, let's get the emergency access only. So we can't go in here yet, I betcha. The map lights up if there's a leak. Okay, well, where are we? Level one, we are in sick bay right here. So level two will be off main office, office one and office two. Ooh, more room. Here's where we exit. Alright. That door only opens in an emergency. Okay, so we have the trigger something. Alright, I feel like something's gonna fucking come get us. Okay, how do we go down the hallway? Here we go. Now we're gonna go to, to floor two. Check out these offices. Is he gonna freak out again? Okay, good. <laughs> Thought we were gonna have another cutscene of him freaking out for going down the stairs. I think he should be over it now. Now I hate to do this, but looking at time, I'm going to cut the video here. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and I will see you in the next part of The Bunker. We're going to see what the hell we find in this place that he's so afraid of.